Are you looking to level up your Adobe Illustrator game? Do you want to work faster, more efficiently, and in a broader range of styles? Then this class is for you. We are DKNG Studios, the design and illustration team of Dan Culkin, Nathan Goldman, and we've been working together for over 15 years now. We've had the chance to work with some amazing clients, including making postage stamps for USPS, working with musicians and festivals like Eric Clapton and Outside Lands, and movie properties like Star Wars. Our work requires that we bring both a high level of efficiency and creativity to everything that we do. So the faster that we can work and the more ideas that we can bring to the table, the more we've been able to build our portfolio and grow our business. In this class, we're gonna show you how we use Adobe Illustrator and our 10 most recent and favorite top tips and tricks. In this class, we're gonna cover lots of different techniques, such as non-destructive ways of creating your artwork so you have much more editing ability, ways of working in new styles in Illustrator to expand your range of offerings, sharing progress with colleagues or clients, new ways of working with text like gradient fills and warping shapes, tools for maximizing efficiency like keeping all aspects of your project highly editable, and much more. Along the way, you'll get to see a little bit behind the curtain of DKNG and see our actual working files. One of the biggest themes of this class is gonna be working in non-destructive ways. So by that, we mean keeping files as live and editable as possible, and that allows us to prepare for any changes that a client might ask for or that we might want to make along the way. So whether you're a beginner or a seasoned pro, these tips and tricks are sure to help you improve your efficiency and get even more creative. We hope to see you in class. You'll get to see some of our projects and working files along the way. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, that was very relaxed. Yeah, oh yeah, okay. Uh -huh.